I talked to a lot of people who were dealing with the aftermath of, of Hurricane Sandy and so many stories have been, well, last year they talked about uh, Hurricane Irene coming this way and they predicted that the surge was going to be so high and, you know, we all evacuated and we had a really difficult time getting back to our homes uh, after the storm, even though it wasn't that big. So we heard Sandy, we're like, there's no way we're going to leave because it takes way too long to get back in here, so we're going to stay. I wish I would have never stayed. That's the thing I hear over and over and over again. They said it was a living nightmare. People evacuating the second story of their home, looking out the window and seeing boats knocking against that second story window. And just by the grace of God, they survived that. Their window didn't break, second floor didn't flood, the first floor completely flooded, but they would never, never stay in evacuation zone again based on barely surviving last time. You got to know the elements, you got to make a plan. And if you're told to evacuate, evacuate, but also know that you don't have to go to the next state. Perhaps it's just 10 or 15 miles away. You can find a place that is safe for you and your family to be as you ride out the storm.